Hey guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel and today we are going to be taking a look at my custom LEGO compatible irritator. But before we move on to this video, I would just like to announce that this is a collaboration with my friends Extinct Bricks, Zane Adventure, Rexy Act Bricks, Maximum Power, Mechanic Tiger, and Assert 161. The links for their YouTube channel and videos will be in the description box below. Now, let's start with a 360 view and some cool dino facts. This Spinosaurid's name is Irritator, which means irritating. Its height is 3 meters with a length of 6 to 8 meters and it weighs 1,000 kilograms. It lived in the early Cretaceous. Its environment was mostly tropical environment of a coastal lagoon surrounded by dry regions. Its diet consisted of fish and other small dinosaurs it could catch. Irritator is a genus of Spinosaurid dinosaur that lived in what is now called Brazil during the Albion stage of the early Cretaceous period about 110 million years ago. Okay, so now that we're done with the 360 view, let's move on to the Irritator's features, articulation, and the paint scheme. So first of all, uh, what I did to the mount was I cut the pegs and made it look like it have a wider mount range to make it look scarier. For the hands, I didn't do anything but I just kept the same mechanism it does. For the neck, I added a ball joint for some playability and mostly for articulation. I actually based the paint scheme on Jurassic World Alive game. So the paint scheme has a gray base color and with some green patches on the top and some black stripes. The teeth are white and the eyes are yellow. Okay, now that we're done with the features, Let's move on to the size comparisons. So today we are going to be comparing this with some of the other creations I made and some other molds made by alternative brands. So here we have a baby blue. Aw, she's so cute. The irritator can eat her in a bite. The next dinosaur we have is not yet seen before in the channel, but this is our Kentrosaurus. So the Kentrosaurus is quite smaller than the irritator, but close. It's very close. Okay, so moving on. So the next custom will be the Deinonychus. This is actually one of my earlier customs, so it's available already in the YouTube channel. So here you go. Uh, the only thing that made the Deinonychus bigger is because of the crest on its head. Okay, so moving on. We have a Baryonyx. And just get the baryonics and um where is it oh here so the baryonics is very large compared to the irritator um the lego jurassic world mode isn't that accurate but i guess it's fine just to like make it look it's bigger and scarier the next one is my favorite spinosaurid i mean yeah it's my favorite it's the spinosaurus so the Lego brand that made this is actually 818. I'm not familiar of the brand, but they're a pretty solid brand. They made a Spinosaurus. I love it. Like, yeah. That's it, guys. So that was the video, guys. I want to thank you guys for 600 plus subscribers. That's my biggest milestone yet. I also unlocked the community post. Now I can share and tease you guys about some of the new customs I'm making. Yes, I'm back from making customs, so hooray. And um, I want to thank you. I want to thank my friends for collabing with me and letting me join in this collab. I'm going to be um, customizing that Spinosaurus because it looks inaccurate, even though it's quite good. But yeah, I'm going to customize it. So that's the video guys, leave a like, comment, and subscribe. That would really make my day. Here's some pics.
Wave D three. Here's a little sneak peek on my newest custom. Dun 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 dun. dun.